Well, as we get closer to summer, of course, taking care of your skin becomes more and more important. And since next week is Sun Awareness Week, we thought it'd be important to bring in a doctor to share some tips for protecting your skin. So joining me this morning, Dr. Mark Berkowitz. Thank you so much for being with us Thanks from the Michigan Hair Restoration. You are a cosmetic surgeon. You focus on the face, correct? I do. That's correct. So you deal with a lot of skin cancer. I do. Unfortunately, you know, people get skin cancers around the eyelids. Uh, it's quite common because they don't apply uh, sunblock in those areas. Right, and it's hard. How do you best protect your eyes from the sun? Sunglasses, a good hat with a brim on it will help as well. So when people are trying to think about uh, you know protecting themselves, um, it's not just a sunny day that you have to worry about. Even on a cloudy day, yeah, right? Even on a cloudy day in Michigan, 80% of those rays will come through. And it's not the burn from the UVB, it's the UVA that can cause the damage for us. And that comes through on a cloudy day as well as a sunny day. So what's the best rule of thumb when you're administering sunscreen? So number one, you must use it and you must use it every day. Number two, you have to use an ample amount, and that usually means one ounce. It's like a shot glass I've That's heard right. it compared to yeah, before. Yeah, a shot That's glass. That's a lot. It's a lot. Yeah, it's a lot, and you have to apply it before going out, like 30 minutes beforehand, so it can saturate your skin. Now, I've heard anything over SPF 30 is just numbers, and it doesn't matter. Does yeah. it? It does SPF 100 really help you more, or? Yeah. So once you get to 30, you're blocking out 95 to 96 percent. So, you know, if you want to block even more, you can do more of a physical sunblock, so like a zinc oxide, or, mm -hmm. but many people are embarrassed to wear something like All that. Right, with the, the white <laughs> nose, you know, like you were really a kid. Um, now, before the show, um, behind the studio, you brought in a machine that will actually show s sun damage on the face, and you did a scan of my face. So there it is, and what did you find in so, the scan? So, congratulations, number uh -oh. one because you do have less sun damage than others your age, race, and gender. Oh, okay. So, th so that's a really good thing. So you're that's taking great good news. care of your skin. Okay. Um, but, but for people who do have sun damage, we can reverse it at our Accents Cosmetic Surgery. How do you reverse it? So there's a few different things that we do. Um, I think we may show a picture later where we did, like Kim Kardashian had a vampire facelift. So what that is is we draw blood, we spin it out, and that has uh, platelet growth factor in it, and it actually helps to turn back time. Really? Yeah. That does sound <laughs> kind of spooky, but hey, if it works, right? Now, you are teaming up with Detroit Lions linebacker Stephen Tullock uh, with, you know, Sun in Mind as well. Tell us a little bit about that adventure. So I'm excited about that. That's next Friday in uh, Dearborn at King Boring Field. Uh, Stephen's an amazing man. Uh, he's put together this event. It's the sixth annual celebrity softball event. There'll be over 50 of the Detroit Lions at the event. Got and we'll cool be giving hats. away, uh, myself and Michigan Hair Restoration, 555 of these hats to protect you from the sun uh, for the first 555 people who show up. Uh, the event is terrific because Stevens Foundation helps to raise money for inner city Detroit kids for Great all class. the equipment that they don't have. He brings them computers, paper, whatever they need uh, in order Great to enough. help them succeed in school. And you're one of the coaches. And we also have to say that Brad Galley and Justin Rose from our sports department are going to be playing in the celebrity softball game. So we wish all of the players the best of luck. Thank you so much for Thank being you. with us. Mark. You've been great. Great tips for everybody out there. Remember, wear that sunscreen. After the break, Keenan will let us know how sunny it will be for today and the rest of the weekend for the Chevy Detroit Bell Isle Grand Prix.